Alright, hi guys, N42 here with another video. This is episode one of what we're trying to do as a weekly show here. It will be called the five minute clock. It will be five minutes of me talking about um, big news stories that are going on in NASCAR and kind of what I think about them. Obviously, the big news stories this week are the Roval, the playoff eliminations, um, and maybe even like the TV ratings back from Richmond. Also, some of these um, Xfinity drivers coming up to the Cup Series, such as Daniel Hemrick and AJ Allmendinger. Um, Daniel Hemrick's, I didn't think he's ready, but. He's, he made it to the last round of qualifying in the cup race today, or on Sunday. Um, he's really consistent in the Xfinity Series. He's going to be in a decent car. Um, 31 is a pretty good car. You, I mean, Ryan Newman's been able to get some top 10s and stuff this year. Austin Dillon's in the playoffs. He's 19 points ahead of the cut line. It's a good team. It's a better team than a lot of people think it is. Um... We'll see what Hemrick can do in that 31 car. And Priest in the 47. I think Priest needs another year in Xfinity. It's great that he was able to make it to Cup, but he probably needs another year in Xfinity. Um, I don't think he's even had a full year yet in Xfinity. That's kind of what I want to see him do. Because he, he's won, like, what, one Xfinity race? He's not been bad, but it's just I haven't seen him, like, in a full season. But, you know... I would also obviously like to see Chastain go somewhere, um, whether it's for a full-time Xfinity team or um, a full-time Cup team, but it better be a really good team that he can win races at. Um, it looks like Chip Ganassi will give him more opportunities, though. Another thing we could talk about now, now we're, we're going to have to talk about the Roval tonight. That's a crazy race right now. We've already seen practice. We've already seen qualifying. They're wrecking all over the place, um, and that that's how it's going to be in the race. Um, I said in my predictions video, 10 or more cautions. It's going to be 10 or more cautions in this race, and probably that or more, you know. Um, I don't even have, like, have a prediction for this race. I don't know if any of you saw, but on Twitter I said, um, go follow me, by the way, at NT. DC42. It's pretty much at and then my YouTube channel name should find me. Um, I said on Twitter in, a, in a com one of the comments I made, I said I picked a pace car to win the race, and, and that, that's a pretty bad pick right now. So um, don't pick the pace car at, at the roll because even, even he's going to wreck. Um, I probably take, I don't even know. Everybody's like, oh, AJ Allmendinger are so good at work for this. Yeah, well, he won once three, four years ago. And he's like the best ever driver at a road course. Marco Sambros is better than him. I don't even know who I'm going to take. Maybe Chase Elliott. Maybe Chase Elliott. He's looked good in qualifying. He's he survived to qualifying. He survived... Um, testing he survived a bunch of stuff maybe martin truex jr those are really the only two i can see i uh, run out of time here still got another minute but you know um by the way go watch my stop motion i just made it it's up on youtube go watch that that's a great video and it only has like less than 10 views which it does not deserve so go watch that um Oh, what should we talk about? Um, yeah, Gregson doesn't really deserve to be in the one. Maybe another year in trucks and then the one. Uh, he's been best equipment, but only won one race. And um, also planning to pos I'm planning to possibly do some more streaming soon, so look out for that. And uh, I can't wait for the Roval, and the, this is five minute clock thing. I mean, time's right now, but we're going to try to do one of these once a week, so see how you like it.